Let's learn about drawing shadows on canvas. Here we have a canvas with an ID my canvas, 2 pixels, black dotted border. Also note that we have this video tutorials, previous video tutorial of drawing a text on the canvas. Please visit technotip.com for this video or the link present in the description section of this YouTube video. In this video we will show how to draw shadow to our text we have a property called shadow color to specify color of the shadow we can give hexadecimal value or striped text string that is color name here this will draw some black spot but to make it look like shadow we need to control its blur property by default it's 0 if we increase the value of shadow blur some blurred effect of that shadow color will be displayed we also have we can set offset value of x axis and y axis using offset shadow offset x and shadow offset y properties. I'll set this to 10, 10 pixels. So offset x 10 pixels. Now let me show you shadow offset y. I'll even set this to 10 pixels. Remember all these values by default are 0. Let me show the same effect on a circle. I'll be writing the arc method please visit technotip.com and search for drawing circles on canvas using html so first two parameters are x and y axis value second the third one is the radius fourth one is the starting angle and the last one here is the ending angle which is 360 degree our circle comes somewhat uh, almost at the right ending corner let me stroke it and show you the exact location so here so you can already look at the shadow on that i'll just cut this and paste at the bottom so that the stroke style value is applied onto my circle too that is the cyan color what if we fill oh let me first show you how it looks if you write the negative values here negative offset values the shadow just shifts upwardly here in this case have a look so it looks nice here I'll show you let me fill this circle with some color already we have fill style is equal to blue I'll just Call the fill method over here which fills the circle with blue color so you can clearly see the black shadow behind it somewhat looks like behind it so I'll just comment this these offset values and show you how it looks so the shadow is immediately behind it you could see it uh, behind the circle too let me completely remove these shadow settings and refresh here so this clearly shows how a circle really is and how it looks once you apply shadow settings to it so just have a look at the changes here so this is how we apply shadow property to our elements like text rectangle circles any kind of arcs or any image on our canvas stay subscribed to technotip.com and to our youtube channel please pass on this video to your friends on facebook google plus linkedin twitter etc also like this video on youtube